This news is tracking developing news now out of Central Falls, where a fast-moving fire at a mill building turns into a hazmat situation. We've learned several firefighters were taken to the hospital after battling a fire that started by a paint-mixing process. Eyewitness News reporter Kelly Sullivan has the developing details from the Blackstone Valley Mobile Newsroom. More than a half dozen fire departments responded to this chemical fire here at this factory in Central Falls. And not only was it the hazardous material that caused problems for firefighters, but it was also today's heat. Temperatures spiked to new levels inside the General Polymer building on Foundry Street in Central Falls. Central Falls Fire Chief Robert Bradley says workers were mixing flammable liquids with resins to make paints when a 300-gallon vat ignited. When we got here, there were two men on the roof. And another ladder truck was over there, I guess, breaking through. All you can really see is smoke coming out the back. Companies from as far away as Warwick filled the narrow streets as firefighters battled an intense chemical fire. Not only was it challenging to use the right materials to put the flames out, but today's high temperatures also caused problems. We had several firefighters who have been transported to the hospital for evaluation. And all the firefighters have been going out, getting uh, medical attention, getting IVs and uh, just constant supply of trying to reload on fluids. The fire department will also need to be reloading with new and expensive gear. Pretty much most of the firefighting gear that the firefighters wore at this point is all contaminated and it has to be thrown away. Despite the intensity from the burning chemicals, firefighters were able to contain the flames to a section on the first floor. Chief Bradley says there are still a lot of hazardous chemicals, though, in the basement. Once the, the proper cleanup is done, the building will go back into operation. I'm not sure any exact time, but it, it will definitely be back in operation in the future. It will also take time to determine what caused the fire. And Central Falls Fire Chief tells me hazmat crews will be on scene throughout the evening. Reporting from the Blackstone Valley Mobile Newsroom, Kelly Sullivan, Eyewitness News.